I don't think there are enough words to obviously um, cover all that Pat has done for women's basketball, um, for all of us individual players. Um, I mean, we all could sit around and talk about her and share funny stories and, um, you know, just everybody. I've talked to a lot of former players. Um, they've come back into town and, you know, Candace was here and Ketch was here and um, just her impact and that she's made on women's basketball. Um, she's the reason that we're on ESPN. She's the reason that we're competitive and that we have a fire under us and that we want to win and that, you know, we cry when we lose and that we're passionate about basketball. Um, I think for most players my age um, and probably older, um, it's because of Pat. And for all the kids that are younger, we're just telling them all about her and uh, reminding them why we're here um, and that it's because of her. Um, she fought for women and she fought for us to be able to play and she fought for our talent and athleticism to be recognized um, by men and, and by everybody, really, um, that doubted that women could be competitive. And uh, she fought um, from the time she got her job to you know, her passing, she was always fighting, um, whether it's for herself or fighting for us or for the game or for us to get more games on TV or to get better games. And, you know, she was just always fighting. And uh, she just had that in her, anyone that knew her. Um, but she was also always loving and caring about everyone. Um, so I think, you know, she just had that perfect balance. She would be, you know, crazy and passionate and fiery on the court and then want to sit down and talk about her dogs or cooking or, or Tyler or school or anything that was going on in life off the court. And so I think she taught us how to be competitors and how to be women um, and how to be fiery and passionate and competitive and how to be caring and strong. So yeah, we all love her and we'll miss her a lot.